The All-American Qualifiers, presented by Champion Tempting Dash. Sire of Ain't She Tempting, a multiple Grade 2 winner and Grade 1 placed. And by three-time Grade 1 finalist, Hawkeye, both standing at Granada Farms. Second Fastest, Day 2, FDD Scout. In the world of scouting, there is a long process to become an eagle. FDD Scout has climbed a similar ladder. First came victory in the Rudoso Juvenile, then a trial win and a spot in the Rainbow Finals, where he finished fourth. And now he's an All-American finalist. Running. Rumi going round, drifted out at start. FDD Scout and Phenomenal broke on even terms. Debut on just a cool boy is trying to keep up. And then Orange Cap outside is Genesis 1. And it's FDD Scout. Phenomenal is not being able to keep up. FDD Scout in front. And it's FDD Scout. Tanner Tedford was aboard just as he has been for all of the Gelding's five starts. FDD Scout has really blossomed this summer, but according to the Trey Woodbarn, he didn't start out that way at the farm. You know, he really didn't show much. He was just kind of another horse, a uh, little short, squatty thing. And when he came to the racetrack, he kind of blossomed and turned into uh, a racehorse, I guess you could say. Um, it kind of just changed his whole attitude. Owner Breeder Paragon Farms is a major beneficiary of FDD Scout's attitude adjustment. He was offered in the Rudos a select sale last year, but farm owner Tom Leeper hung on to it. A great decision. Now, FDD Scout is charting a new path, one that could end in All-American victory. Tune in to the Cowboy Channel on Labor Day for complete coverage of All-American Weekend.